Welcome to another episode as we do a road trip around West Virginia and check out all the adventurous activities they have to offer. We just checked into the Bavarian Inn in Shepherdstown, West Virginia, and this place is honestly like a European fairy tale. Like, it's got these crazy old German style buildings here. Let's go check it out together. After checking in and dropping our bags off, we headed out to explore the town and walk along the river. We've woken up this morning and it's one of those days where we're not sure if it's going to just rain like crazy or it's actually going to come out and be really nice. Right now, it's really misty, kind of sprinkling. Romantigo is ziplining at 11 o'clock today, so I'm not sure if that's actually going to happen or not. Fingers crossed, because that sounds like a lot of fun. But for now, we're just going to cruise on into town, get some brekkie and see what the weather does. So the good news is zip lining goes rain, hail or shines. We just checked in with the guys at River Riders and it's time to go out there. There's eight zip lines in total. So we're gonna swap over to the GoPro and go and check it out. Apparently there's even one that goes right over the river. So excited for that. Get the hell out of here. What? That is amazing. We have a bed each. Yes! I don't have to sleep with Jared tonight. Today in West Virginia, we are exploring the beautiful and historical town of Harpers Ferry, right on the banks of the Shenandoah and Potonac rivers. Now this place is steeped in Civil War history, but not only that, it is absolutely gorgeous. We're gonna be walking around, catching up with Leah Tabor, one of the park rangers here in town to learn all about the history of this special place. The entire town of Harpers Ferry is an incredible display of the preserved historical sites, mainly from the industrial era of the mid 1800s. The town played a significant role in the American Civil War and there are a number of landmarks to reflect the events that impacted the US history. So we've just finished with Leah and we've learned all about this historical town. She's given us a few tips on some hikes in the area so we're going to go check out one now and get a beautiful view of the rivers and where they meet. After finishing up in Harpers Ferry, we headed west towards Seneca Rock. Before we get to our next destination of Blackwater Falls, we decided to stop off at one of the most iconic spots here in West Virginia, Seneca Rocks. There's this huge rock formation behind us. We're going to hike up to the top. We've been told it's about two hours. Let's go. That waterfall was amazing. I'm so stoked we had a chance to check that out. Anyway, we just got to our accommodation and we're staying at the Blackwater Falls State Park Lodge. 
And this is it right here. We have got a enormous room. We're only here for one night, unfortunately, because we've got to keep on heading west to hit our final destination. So we're going to make the most of it, get some pizza, enjoy the park while we're here, and then just kick back, relax, back up some videos and photos, and uh, yeah, just enjoy a night at Black Waterfall State Park. Nothing quite like a delicious wood-fired pizza with my baby. End of view. It's been one of those mornings. We did know about it yesterday, but it, the rain came earlier than what we thought. So we missed out on the waterfall hike this morning because it was bucketing down, but it's so lovely to see because we're up here in the mountains. But now we're off to another destination. It's called the New River Gorge and we have an exciting activity to do there. Oh, we just got to our accommodation for the next two nights. We're staying at the Adventure on the Gorge Park. It is just outside of the National Park itself. And we're staying in one of their beautiful little cabins they've got right here in the forest. And this is it. Big old timber cabin taking the shoes off because the feet are wet. And this is it. Nice and big and spacious. So yeah, it's pretty big actually. And they told us that if we want wood fire to let them know. And yeah, there's a, a fireplace outside. We can roast marshmallows, which we don't have. Maybe we can get later oh, on. Oh, we're getting on s'mores. Oh, oh my gosh, s'mores. Oh my gosh, s'mores are the best. And the reason we are here for two nights is because tomorrow we have a full day adventure. We are going whitewater rafting on the lower New River. Now, we've heard this place is pretty damn fast, so we're very excited for that. I haven't been whitewater rafting since I was a little kid. Alicia hasn't been since she was like 18 in Bali, so something new and exciting for us. <laughs> Maybe if this rain clears, we might actually get a hike in. We'll have to see what happens. We're standing on the Fayette Bridge, which was the original connection between Fayette and South Fayette. Now, back in the day, before this big bridge was built, this is the only way to get across the river. You had to drive down this crazy switchback road, come over this old bridge, and then cruise on back up the other way. Now, back in 1977, they built this bridge, the New River Gorge Bridge, and that turned a 45 minute trip into 45 seconds. So, much more convenient for the people that had to connect between two towns. And now we get this still cool old bridge and we get to drive across anyway. It's our final day here in West Virginia. In fact, our final day in the United States and we're going out with a bang. We are going whitewater rafting with adventures on the gorge. We're going on the second oldest river in the world, the New River here in West Virginia. We've just been told we have a bunch of class four and class five rapids that we're gonna be navigating all day. I'm pretty excited. Alicia's a little bit nervous. She won't show it on the camera though. She's just gonna power on through. So we've just checked in and Doug, our guide, told us it's a bit chilly out there, so it's best to rent some wetsuits. So we've just gone into the gift store, we've rented some wetsuits, and now we're gonna pick it up at the rental place. Big fun. <laughs> there's no I in team, there's no in swim. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we've just got to the river. Doug, our guy, who is hilarious, by the way. I feel like we're in very good hands here. I feel like he lives on the river, so I'm feeling way more confident now. Uh, he gave us a full safety briefing and cracked a lot of jokes on the bus. And now it's time to find our boat, jump on in, and start paddling. in a place for lunch and we've done a heap of class fours and class fives. We started off with class threes to get us all warmed up and work as a team with the boat. Our guide, uh, Doug, is amazing. He is guiding us. I was a weaker link at one stage, but he's guiding us to be better. I kept leaning in the boat and he said lean into the waves. So it's actually, it's amazing. You're getting so much guidance as you're on the boat as well. It doesn't stop. Ooh, lunch is pretty good. Yeah, look at this. We've got some fruit, some chocolate dessert, and then I've got a wrap. Oh, good. Nice and healthy too. Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, baby, give me a nice ride. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Phew. That was 
so amazing. That was such a good way to finish our time in West Virginia. Seeing the rapids is so much fun. You did really well. I'm proud oh, of you. Thank you so much. You, he was right in front of me blocking the water as we went over rapids. <laughs> All right, now we're going to jump on the bus, head on back to Adventures on the Gorge, and then we're going to go find somewhere to eat for dinner because I am rabid. We are both exhausted after the light water rafting, but it's our last day in West Virginia, our last day in the United States. So we can't just like go back to the cabin and chill out. Alicia has talked me into a hike. So I was talking to some of the locals around and I said to them, if you were to do one hike, you had a short period of time, which one would you do? And all of them said Long Point Trail. So this is where we are now. We're doing this hike. It's about two points. 2.57 kilometers, exactly one way. <laughs> so we've got about five kilometers to walk out, but it's literally just flat the whole way. So we're just gonna walk out there, apparently get a beautiful view of the gorge, and then we'll hike back, and then we'll go get some dinner. Okay, last night here in the US and we are packing up all that stuff, going away, cameras are going away. It's a long flight back to Australia, making sure we don't forget anything. It was a long drive back to DC, bringing us to the end of our seven day West Virginia road trip. We're so stoked we had the chance to dive into this beautiful state in the USA. From historical towns to crazy hikes and the thrill of class five rapids, this place has it all. For us though, it's time to head on home and get ready for the next big adventure. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications as we bring out a new video every week. Thanks for watching guys and we'll see you on the next adventure.